So Tim and Rick are like legends in the reseller channel. You know, everybody wants to know how can we be like Tim and Rick. You know, we'll do a software demo with Rick and he'll be like in the Bahamas on his boat, you know, having Mai Tais or whatever, and he's working. And we're, every time we see these guys, we're like, how can we do what you do? They were doing remote workforce before that was even cool. That's been something that has made us part of this epic place to work journey is that, you know, it ties back to Rick and Tim being agile and writing code on a train. It's kind of been in our blood. It's been in our story all along was that you didn't need to be tied down at a desk in an office all day long, we could build a company really from anywhere. We decided to get on a train. Yeah. Well, it, it, there were a couple things though. We could we could have gone off to a beach house or something. Yeah. Right. But by going to the cities, I think it was your idea because you're the network guy. Let's meet some people. Right. And we show them what yeah. we're doing. I do remember. Yeah. I mean, sitting across from each other at that table yeah. where you were doing the coding, I'm writing the next part of the documentation. You turn your your laptop around and say, "Is this what you're looking for?" Right. And I, right. you know, uh, well, we let's change this or change that, you know. And if you think back to what we know today about agile development, yeah, this was like as agile it gets. Yeah. It's like the the, <laughs> right. the, the stakeholder and the developer yeah. working together yeah. in an intimate fashion, yeah. you know, getting feedback. That on Absolutely. the train we were able to, you know, start building relationships with partners in each one of these cities. We've got. Um, a, an opportunity to grow our teams across the United States and even other parts of the world because we have figured out a way to build connection with our staff and uh, still create a very flexible work environment. From a culture perspective, we're, we're like a big family. Relationships have always been an important part of our company and you see that from the Tim and Rick and Scott you know, leadership team all the way down that we want to take care of our customer and build great products for them and, and make sure that they're happy. We try to keep long-standing relationships with our partners and customers and we try to make decisions around that so I think that has a lasting impact. Part of this whole culture thing that's so important to both of us, I think the underpinning of that for me is we always try to do the right thing. You honor your customers, you're honest with your customers and you want to fulfill the, the needs. Yeah. And so from a technical standpoint, from my side, um, I want to deliver a product that, that really makes people happy yeah. and, and serves their purpose. The loyalty and the, the, yeah. the continuity, I think, brings real value. Yeah. And it's great that Scott, in the same way, is very interested Absolutely. in, that, in that, that process. Yeah, and of course, if we hadn't felt that way, we wouldn't have right. asked him to come on board with us. Exactly. So exactly. I'm glad he'll be carrying the torch Forward. Right, yeah. along with Ainsley. Yeah. yeah. A lot of people talk about, oh, I have a great job, or, you know, I have a great career, or my company's great. And so I thought about it, and I was like, I don't want great, I want epic. I want people to literally sit down and talk to their families and their kids someday and say, I hope you get to work in a place that I worked at. The people, the projects, the things you get to do, and it's, it, it really has happened at SK. We've, we've made really good progress in what we were trying to accomplish as a company, but I'm mostly proud of what we've done in the family and the connections we've made with each other and our business partners and our customers. So it's really life-changing if you can work in a place like that. And that's, that's what SK Soft is, is all about. And that has uh, played into how SK Global has become who we are today, is that epic place to work at the root of it has been that we want employees to just get up in the morning, love what they do, and that that fosters a love of their life. So what do I think about the future? You know, Scott being the visionary that he is, sometimes I'm on phone calls and he's created 10 businesses in an hour and there's so many directions that we could go in and they're all very exciting. So I'm not really worried about the future. I feel like there's a lot that we could do as a company. The company has just kept evolving over time and in every day is pretty exciting. Scott has a good vision and our customers keep giving us ideas that we act on. So uh, I see ourselves keep moving forward every day, which is pretty exciting.